What's up YouTube? Today we're going to be discussing how to build a projector screen for under $4. I'll send the full parts list in the description below. First of all, we're going to have to start off with two rolls of gift wrapping paper. And now I went with this because it was the only one available at deals. Um, we're looking at about 100 inches by about 40 inches. This is a high gloss. And we got two rolls. Two things of double sided scotch tape and regular scotch tape. And then scissors for. We just need to unwrap this. So we're gonna tape it along the top part so that it's dangling down. And we're using a couple pieces of double sided scotch tape to fill in the bottom part. Whenever you do projector screens like this, you always start with the top first so that it layers. Before we move on too much further, I just wanted to show you I got the top first half already taped up, but I just wanted to show you the difference between. Um, a standard wall and how much of a projector screen actually the reflectiveness actually makes a difference. As you can tell it's a lot darker on the bottom but on the top it's a lot brighter which means that you can turn your bulb on to eco mode and be able to watch movies with more of a brightness without having to push your projector too much. But yeah we see that the colors are a whole lot more um, popping out on the top part. Tell you what I did taped it up with the regular scotch tape, not the double sided, and tried to tension it out by putting pieces of tape opposite of where the rest would look. And now we'll move on to the second piece. And we will put it about halfway up if we can, if not a little bit lower, and then make it so the bottom is flush right there. See that I started putting double sided stick tape all the way down the lower. The completed project. I know it doesn't look super professional, but if you're doing this, you're probably not buying a professional screen. So for $4 from deals, I sure can get the job done. And what I'm doing it, using it for is a 120 inch screen for my projector. And as you can see, it really does make those colors pop. Thank you for watching.